Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Google Chrome for desktop has a performance section in the settings that lets you manage your performance by using the memory saver and then the energy saver to manage your power. Now it seems that Google is going to be working on improving the speed of the browser, which I think is a nice move in the right direction. And that's a new feature that's been tested now in Chrome Canary version 119. And if we head over to the settings in this latest preview version of the browser and we head to the performance page over and above memory saver and energy saver, we now get a speed section. So it seems now that obviously this is going to be part and parcel of the performance uh, section and functionality of the browser. And if we just have a closer look at this new section, which by the way, I noticed in an overnight update to Chrome Canary, it says preload pages, choose whether to preload pages. So um, I did notice that standard preloading was on by default and no preloading says pages load only after you open them. Standard preloading, which is the default, some of the pages you visit are preloaded. So when on, browsing and searching is faster. Chrome preloads pages you're likely to visit so that they load more quickly when you visit them. Things to consider. If you allow cookies, Chrome may use them when preloading. So obviously there could be a bit of a privacy concern with this feature. But nonetheless, just moving on. And then if we head to extended preloading, and we just expand that, it says more pages are preloaded. Pages may be preloaded through Google servers when requested by other sites. So when on, browsing and searching is faster than standard preloading. Chrome preloads even more pages that you're likely to visit so that they load more quickly when you visit them. Things to consider, obviously, once again, if you allow cookies, Chrome may use them when preloading. When a site asks to privately preload links on their page, Chrome uses Google servers this hides your identity from the preloaded site, but Google learns what sites get preloaded. So although this could be uh, speeding up your Google Chrome web browser and enhancing the overall performance in conjunction with the memory saver and the energy saver, there could be a little bit of a privacy concern here. But nonetheless, I'm actually going to keep this on extended preloading just to try this out because um, that would obviously be the most um, extreme kind of example in this case when it comes to the preload and preloading of those pages to improve uh, the speed and this seems to be very similar to the prefetch feature we get uh, in actually in the actual windows operating system so this is going to be an interesting one to watch and um, actually i'm quite happy they have um, posted and placed this in the actual browser to try and improve the speed and i'm um, over and above now the memory power and the speed improvements um, I'll keep a close eye on this one and obviously I'll let you know if I notice any improvements when it does come to speed and the overall performance with this new um, toggle turned on and it's still early days this is not available in the stable version uh, but this is a feature that I do personally um, do think should roll out to the stable version to increase the overall performance of Google Chrome so thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one